What's up, Internet? It's Arlie, and I'm here with another video. Ho, ho, ho! It is your new Internet Emperor. Um, so, I've been watching these dick appointment videos because, you know, sometimes you get on YouTube and you just watch the, the deep, deep web, just parts of the... You just watch the weird side of YouTube. I, was, I went from watching, like, fucking H3, H3, to en ending up on these channels where these girls talk about dick appointments with their sexy thumbnails. So, we're going to talk about dick appointments. Since I've only, I've only seen it from the female point of view, I figured, why don't I put my two cents in? And I say, hey, you know, that's not cool. You know, you... <laughs> There should be more guys coming out and speaking about this because you know in these videos They talk about dudes having stinking breath and things like that Let's go ahead and talk about what females need to do to get ready before someone like me comes over or another guy Okay, look at me. I'm, I'm sweet and tasty. Who wouldn't want a dick appointment from me? Okay, I know exactly what I'm talking about so Let's, let's start with number one. Number one, okay? Number one, number one. Always, always wear lingerie, ladies. Wear lingerie. I know that seems like a, a crazy standard and that you should be comfortable, you know, wearing your granny panties, but that's just not, that's not how this works, okay? I want to come over, especially if I don't know you and I've met you off Tinder and I'm getting, you know, I'm bringing you a dick appointment. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you should be trying to turn me on. Because we don't know each other enough to just know certain things. So wear some lingerie and that thing will go boop. But you know? Okay. So number two, number two, number two. Make sure you shower. Make sure you brush your teeth. Make sure you... There's so many times where I went and provided a dick appointment. And guess what happened? That girl breath smelled like, boy... I want the slapper. That's how I don't hit women, but like, boy, her breath stinks so bad. Boy, <laughs> it made me want to slap myself. <laughs> All right, so I got another one. Uh, you might want to, let's think. So we've got another one. I, I, it's really hard because, you know, I got the lingerie. You want your breath, to make sure your breath don't stink. Make sure your house is clean. You know, if I come over and your house, all oh, shit is everywhere. It's kind of like, it's like, come on now. I'm like, I'm supposed to be your guest. <sighs> if my house cleaner than yours, there's a problem, all right? And uh, I don't consider myself to be a super clean dude, you know? But, uh, yeah, um, what else you need to, oh, yeah, some condoms, you know what I'm saying? Condoms. I'm wearing condoms. I know some girls come up with that excuse. Oh, I can't do latex. I don't want to use latex. But you're going to use it today if you want this dick appointment, okay? Look, look, look. I am not going to go out here and just provide a dick appointment not knowing what you have. You may have AIDS. You may have a yeast infection. I don't know what you have. I'm not trying to get none of that bacteria. I am good, okay? I don't know you. I, we haven't gotten tested. We are not in a relationship for the most part if this is a random dick appointment. So we're going to use condoms or, and some other form of contraceptive just in case I don't fucking slip up. Have a plan B. You know, prepare for these things, okay? Prepare. Now, what, is, what else? What else? What else? I, I don't know what else. I don't know. Um... Yeah, make sure you get them baby wipes. Make sure it's clean. Down. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's your job to control yourself down there, okay? You know, just like I have to wash myself up and take a shower and make sure I'm all good, I expect you to be the same. I don't want to get there and smell catnip when I get down there. You feel me? I don't want to smell catnip cat food. I don't want to smell none of that. We're, we're supposed to be having an extracurricular activity. The, the I mean... And it's in that area, it's in that concentrated area, it should be clean and smelling decent. Okay. Um, oh, 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 make sure you, like I said, your breath, make sure you, you freshen up. If you got brain gum, you know what I'm saying? We both need to be having gum because, you know, over time the breath can get a little, you know. Um, 
Yeah, I mean, I don't know what else. It, I think I think I've touched on everything. You know what I'm saying? Like nothing. Much. And also, and also, you know what I'm saying? Don't if I man, do not be one of them females when I get there and be like, so you try to pay twenty fifty. I don't pay for I don't pay for that. It's called a dick appointment. Not to pay for a I'm not gonna say a P word. I'm not gonna say the V word. I'm not paying to come and have extracurricular activities. This is a dick appointment, meaning I'm appointing the dick, okay? So, anyways, yeah. Other than that, I don't see any other reason. And me personally, I don't want you to record anything. I know some dudes don't care. They're like, fuck it, I want my dick in my face everywhere. I want to be a porn star. Me, I want things to be secretive and quiet, you know? This is some, some grade A dick, okay? I don't want my dick everywhere. Anyways, I think that's, that, that's how to prepare for a dick appointment. I mean, I don't know what else. Oh, you want to make sure you dress nice? You know, what you got on is sexy. You know what I'm saying? We might go to the mall before we provide that dick appointment. You know what I'm saying? We might go to the mall, and then when you get back to the house, you know what I'm saying? When we get back to the house... Well, you ready? You pulled off all your clothes. You got that lingerie on. You know what I'm saying? You uh, 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 ready to go? I hope my mom doesn't see this video, cause then she's really gonna know. I mean, I've been, you know, <laughs> but my mom's probably thought I was a goody two shoes type dude, cause I, she's the only thing she's ever seen is me make videos. She's never. I don't. I don't think I can recall her seeing. I think she's seen me with a girl, but she's never seen me. Like, get lovely with a girl. I just don't... I, I've never brought certain things around my mom, okay? Or my even my dad. Like, I've never brought certain things around. It just... It was never seen. A, a lot of the things I do are private. A lot of things I have done are private. So, if my mom sees this... Hi! It's the internet. Hello. <laughs> Anyways, this is how to prepare for a dick appointment. Make sure you're ready, ladies. And, uh, yeah. Um, peace.